What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another Q and A with Aunt Christina and Leia. Hi. Oh, she waved. How cute. So we got all these questions from you guys, hundreds of questions from other platforms. Check us out on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and that's where you can always ask us these questions. All right, make sure you guys subscribe to our channel, like, share, comment on anything that you want, anything that helps you guys out. We're here for you and that's why we're doing this Q&A. We love you guys and we appreciate every single question that you guys gave us. So we're gonna go ahead and answer the first question and it says, from Twitter, we have Kaji Kunido. Uh, what is the biggest change that you've seen in lifestyle from before Leia's birth to after. He keeps rolling around. There oh. she goes. Before her, we were vlogging. We didn't have to deal with her moving around yeah. so much. What do you see in a lifestyle change? We don't get to do as much stuff anymore. We don't get to go anywhere. Right now our friends are on road trips, vacations in Hawaii. Going camping. Going camping because it's a little difficult bringing a baby everywhere, especially with uh, her feeding situation. Even being at home, lifestyle changed a lot. We don't get a lot of time for ourselves. It's okay. I still love what I do right now and I love every bit about it. And we stay home a lot too because it takes at least an hour just to get ready and to leave the house. Sometimes I, two hours. Yeah, sometimes two hours and I think we're okay with it. I think we've accepted it and I don't think we regret anything nope. with that. I do not. No regrets. Next question is from not Carla from IG. I don't know why you're not. Are you Carla or are you not Carla? Mm -hmm. Are you Leia? At what age will you guys let Leia start dating? I'm gonna be honest and real with you. I'm not gonna set uh, an age an age frame for her. I mean, whenever she's ready, I'll let her. But the Ooh. boys is another topic. Yeah. That's another thing. With Leia, you know, she's gonna learn a lot and respect and, you know, when she's ready, she can. Because we can only control it so much too. Yeah, she can make her own decisions. To a certain extent. The longer we can prolong it, the better. Leia. Yeah. No dating. Yeah, because I don't want boys to break her heart or anything either. I've been there and it's oh, tough. Oh, I, I didn't know. even think about that. See? Ugh. Let's go to the next question. Okay, anyway. Jason V, 1993. What was your first date like with each other? Um, what was our first date? I don't know. What was our first date? Was it Denny's? That wasn't a first date, was it? I don't well, know. Well, that's all I can think of. Yeah. Is is taking Christina out to Denny's at two in the morning after work. Cause she has a late night job. We would just eat before going home. I don't know if that was a date, but that is all I can remember. Oh, I don't really remember what our first date was. What? She just unbuttoned my shirt. Oh no. Help. Did they see it? All right. So the next question is from, oh my God, it's Becky. Oh, is it, is it, is it, is it, oh, or ooh. Ooh. Oh, my old face. Oh. She's watching oh. you right now. Oh. oh okay, read, read the question. The, Don't look at me. The question is, what do you want Leia's first words to be? Love you guys. Literally look forward to your videos because they make my day. Awesome. Triple heart. Triple heart. Let's not Thank you for that. watching our videos because yes. it makes our day knowing that it makes your day. I want her first words to be mom. Or mama. Or mama. Why do you care so much? Because I had her in my belly for nine months and I gave birth to her. So what I happens? I sacrificed my body for her. So what happens if she goes, eh? She's not gonna say aunt first. <laughs> <laughs> she might. No way. You don't know. She could say dad dad first because I if, heard it's easier. What if she says Christina? Yeah, okay. Kind of doing this thing where Daddy? she goes, mama, mama, mama. But that's not that mama. Count? That's not Does mama. Does that count? I'll no. take anything I can get. That's mumbling. I think it just means it's more meaningful to moms. Hey, hey. Mama. I'm, I'm daddy. Mama. Mommy. I'm daddy. Mommy. No, I don't care what she says first. Yeah, that's why I'm like, oh, might as well let me have it then because if I want her to say it, it's gonna you're be gonna so be, much fun to You're setting yourself up because you don't know what she's gonna say. I know. And that's why I'm not trying to be like that. As long as it's not daddy first. You never know. <laughs> All right. You probably do this... that when you're at home and I'm at work. You're like, daddy, daddy, say daddy, daddy, huh? Oh, look at that face. You probably Sometimes. do. See, I knew it. All right, next question is okay. from Jenny Hu. Uh, Jenny Hu says, how many babies do you guys plan to have? By the way, you guys are awesome for responding back to us. So thank you. And thanks for all you do with the vlogs and skits. And thanks, Pat. <laughs> yes. yes. Thank you, Pat. Pat, 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 Pat. Oh, you're patting him I... too? Pat, Pat, Pat. How many babies do you guys plan to have? Two at most. I always wanted three because 
three is a party, two is uh, you know, you just have one brother or one sister. Yeah. So that's not fun. I, I do like having two because if we try for a third one and it ended up being twins. Oh, oh no, I that's scary. don't know what to do about that. And, and what are the chances of us having twins? Very high <laughs> because in my family, I have three sets of twins. I have two sets of cousins that are twins and my brothers are twins. To me, it's Ooh. very high. But it skips a generation, right? Oh. Yeah, but my brothers are so much older. But she might have twins. I know. Oh, we're gonna have grand twins. Oh my goodness. Let's not think Yay. that far ahead. <laughs> All right, next question is from Ben the Karate Boy. When Leia grows up, yeah. are you going yeah. to make her play basketball or volleyball? I'm if gonna make her do some karate. If it's one of those, are you going to make her enter in the Olympics? So my question is, why why basketball and volleyball? I don't know, sports? but I've done both in high school. I, basketball, yes, she'll probably play if she likes it. Yeah. Volleyball, if she likes it. Karate chops, I don't care if she likes it. She's gonna learn how to beat people's ass. I want her to take some self-defense classes. Anything to help her to become a better yes. and stronger person. Anything that she wants to do, we're gonna be open to. <laughs> yeah. We just want her to be active, huh, baby? She agreed with that. You agree with that, huh? Hi yeah, 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 yeah. Good daddy. Oh no, she's a yeah. good job. Good job. These are some pretty fun questions. I like these. Next question is from Mary May Hey. What inspired you to do YouTube vlogs, and how long do you wish to keep doing them? Heart, heart, blue hearts. Blue hearts. Crips, Crips hearts. Oh my gosh. So the one thing that inspired us to do vlogs is that all of our friends, they vlogged around us and then we started going on trips with them. I started vlogging us on vacations with yes. everyone, yes. which was really fun because it was our first time going to Hawaii, first time going to Japan, mm -hmm. and that I wanted those memories for us. And also because we went to the Bahamas for our honeymoon, yeah. so we did that on our own. I <laughs> we didn't even release that footage yet. Oh yeah. That's why we started vlogging and then we continued to make it public once uh, she got pregnant the first time. Mm -hmm. And you know, when she got the miscarriage, after a few months of grieving, we've decided to continue and make that public because we thought that we felt like it would help a lot of you. And I'm so glad that it did. That was exactly why we did it. We want to share yep. a story and to try to relate to everyone and try to help people. That's what our channel is all about. It's about being positive and whatever we can do and learn from our experiences and put in a positive outlet for you guys. Uh, that's what we want to keep creating. That is what inspired us to start vlogging in the first place. Yeah. And what was it? How long are we planning on doing it for? As long as we can. We don't know if people are going to watch us when we get older. I know, right? When people vlogging. Are when it be these us? like... 80 year old couple and well i don't think it's gonna be that long oh, oh hey you know, lady we won't even be are, able to hold the camera anymore we're gonna do the spicy ramen challenge what if leia vlogs us when we're all old and stuff now that'll be interesting hey. to see you never know i'm down for that yeah that'll be interesting this is from miss rihanna yeah is that how you say it? yeah miss rihanna j all right rihanna j as leia gets older who do you think between the both of you would be more of a disappearing. Oh, uh, what did you say? <laughs> it bumbled. It, 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 like, it went like, it went like right I was trying to say it like this. <laughs> Who would be more of a disappearing? <laughs> I think it's just you. I think it's just you. I knew it. It wasn't It wasn't because your mouth malfunctioned. It did. Now. It did the exact same thing. <laughs> it did not allow me. So I can't eat. It's the same thing as if you try to roll your tongue. Okay. I can't do that. There's no rolling. Yeah, but my mouth doesn't. <laughs> okay, just say that word. Just say that word so you don't mess up again. Disciplinarian. Okay. Good okay. Job. Hard to say. I I feel like it depends on the situation. I know the struggles that we go through, and I know how girls think. I That's would definitely good. discipline her. I think um, I'll put my foot down. Yeah. No matter what, even though she's so cute. Mm. So. Okay. Next question from X Chelsea T. How much has Leia affected your sleeping? <laughs> Tremendous. Tremendously. Yeah. I don't sleep no more. I pretty much wake up every two to three hours. Honestly, it doesn't bother me too much. I do think about it all the time and I wish I was sleeping right now. I mean, it's for my baby and I do it to help you oh, as well. Thank and you. It is what it is. We appreciate it. So I feel like Leia has affected your sleeping not so much. Well, I used to sleep late and I would barely like run on a few hours of sleep. 
but I do take the last shift and then I take the first shift in the morning. Yeah, true. So I'm waking up a little bit earlier though, probably like an hour earlier. Yeah, that hasn't affected you so much though. That's um, only an hour or two. But it makes a huge difference. For, for me, me is I'm missing like gaps of sleep. Yeah. She has to work from, you know, nine to five and I know that she won't function if she doesn't get her sleep or she'll get headaches and whatnot. So I just do my best to support her and let her sleep as much as she can. So I'll just take the bigger hit. Well, the next question is from Sarah Vengo Echia. Why are you Ow. eating mommy's no. hair? <laughs> Baby. I don't know what talking she's talking right about. Now. What was the worst time you went through during your pregnancy? Hmm. Hmm. Tough question. I was always feeling morning sickness. I think you're always feeling sick and you always had a headache. Oh, true. And you couldn't take medicine. Yeah. Or didn't want to take medicine, yes. which is a good thing. Yes. So I would be, you know, putting a hot compress, cold compress on her, massaging, doing what I can to help yeah. her out. And I didn't feel comfortable. Like, I just, I didn't feel good with the nausea and the headaches that I barely could eat too. Like, I couldn't take anything down. That's probably why she can't eat. It wasn't my fault. I'm sorry, Leia. Christine Tilly. Christine T. Lee, anesthetic Christina 402. Are you guys planning on having another baby anytime soon? By the way, you guys are doing great. She's just and thanks for sharing me. your entire journey with all of us. Heart, heart, heart. She bent over and then she farted in my face. Gross. Thank you, baby. Ouch. Okay. Are you planning on having another baby soon? I want to say, oh, maybe next year? What? As in, we're ready? as in, have it come out next year or yeah. start trying next year? That means we're trying now. True. And I'm not ready. Oh. Uh, I kind of want to keep a little closer together though. So then. Oh, you're ready? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. But we're not ready when it comes to people that are going to take care of her and what we're going to do because. I, I'm not. I'm not responsible enough right now to take care of two yeah well i mean i don't have the time to take care of two right now yeah i want to have another one right now but wanting and being able to take care for another one is totally different true unless i stayed home with the two kids right now i'm not capable of it yeah true that's true all right so what is the final decision on that one um we don't know yeah we don't know we yet. don't know so we'll let you guys know yeah, we don't know yet, but we'll, we'll have to think about it. Okay, so this question is from Caitlin Lino Connell. 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 <laughs> Connell. If Leia could have one definite personality trait in the future that you choose, what would you choose and why? I have one. You have one? Okay. All right, let's say it on three. Yes. All right. One, two, three. Independent. Humble. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I don't know. I, I, I just wish that she will always remain humble, uh, well aware of everything around her. I do like yours too. Yeah. Because if she is independent, she can take care of us. She can take care of us. Yeah. And also, I don't want her to depend on other people for her happiness or success or just to get anywhere in life. And That's I just true. want her to, to be able That's to true. fulfill her own. Yo, yo, yo. WNBA, yeah. happy success, make it rain. And that's all we can ask for. Oh, that's yeah. it. That's it. Uh, we have Sabrina Rina and she says, Hi guys, currently five and a half months pregnant with my first. Do you have any advice to myself and my husband about how to deal with people saying we have to raise our child this certain way or what we can and cannot do as parents? How do we tell them that we are going to raise our child how we want to and we will take, follow any great advice they have but tell them to back up and allow us to do it on our own at the same time. He's Vietnamese and I'm Thai, so traditional families here. Thanks guys. Pink heart, blue heart. My first thing is Blood you can you together. can be open and listen to what they're saying. You don't have to agree with them, you don't have to disagree. But the moment that they're out of your house, you do what you want to do. And if they people are always gonna give you advice about how to raise a kid and what they should be doing and how you should be doing things with them, but like I said, that's your baby. At the end of the day, they're your responsibility. You know what? What? I think uh, you should Take the advice that you get from people. All the advice that we get from all of you in our comments, we read all of them. We take all the advice. Mm -hmm. Because we're so open to it, uh, we do take a lot of the advice and, and kind of alternate it into what we think is best for our child. At the end of the day, we're gonna do what we feel is best yeah. for her. So either way, I still respect everyone giving us advice. I still respect uh, all the comments that you guys give us. I think she needs her banana. 
banana. She's sucking on my shoulder. Where's the banana? Go, 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 go. You want go, this banana? Yay, banana! Banana? She's oh, she's reaching for it. You smarty. Oh my goodness. Good job. Good job, Pepe. All right, so this one is from Veronica Styles, and she says, "Do you guys know BTS and Pretty Much?" You know when I read this, I thought when she said pretty much as in like pretty much you know BTS but it looks like oh. pretty much is like another thing. I guess. Uh, I don't know, I'm gonna look this up and I'm gonna google this right now. Who is BTS? I just know that they're a Korean BTS? boy band. Here we go. 103 million views! Fake love! Alright, let's, let's, let's hear this. Are they Korean? Is a yeah. Korean uh, pop band, boy band, girl band? What is this? Oh my god, it looks like a girl. Yeah. Whoa, how many is there? There's, it looks like seven. There's seven. Is that a guy? Yeah. You know what? I think they're, um, Coming up in the U.S. and then I think they almost won an award or something, right? I think they beat they? they beat Justin Bieber. What? Yeah. Well, yeah. Justin Bieber doesn't do anything anymore. But still, for a Korean band to beat Justin Bieber. Hey. Hey. Are they singing with a Korean accent? Fake a love. Fake a love. Fake a love. How do, is that how Korean? Yeah, fake a. <laughs> you a fake a. So, I don't know who BTS is, but this is my first time seeing this, and they sound pretty good. Yeah, not bad. Du -du 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 -du. Pretty much. Let pretty me see. Much. Who who do you think pretty much is? I have no idea. Pretty much. Another one, yeah, Korean yeah, boy yeah, yeah, band? Yeah, yeah. This one's called oh. Hello. Hey! Oh! Hey! It's Tiger. It's They're tiger. great! Tony the Tiger. I said Tiger. Oh, they're not Korean. What are they? I don't know. Oh, hey. Are they European? Maybe. Oh. Interesting. This sounds like stuff that Leia will listen to when she gets a little older. We'll see. Who knows? Is this the new thing? Is this... This is the new uh, Backstreet Boy I type of so. thing, huh? I think it's better than a lot of the music nowadays because it's all about money and you know girls what? and... I like the rhythm. I like the team they got going on. It sounds like they're together and... Oh, well, it's not bad. And more positive. It's not bad. Yeah. Hey, alright Veronica Styles. Thanks for introducing us to BTS and pretty much. And it's nice to always hear new things and see new things. Oh, yeah, I'm very open. Yeah. Yeah, it was cool. Yeah. I like that. Thank you. Uh, we have... Valred1977 and this person says would you guys ever do a meet and greet? Of course not now with everything going on maybe in the future Love you guys so much your videos have really helped me through some tough days black heart Ooh. That's I a love dark how heart. all of our followers are very considerate because they have to say I know of course not We will probably have a meet and greet soon when we open up our one of our businesses yeah. So we'll let you guys know when that happens. It should be Sometimes this year. I'm always down for meeting greets. Yeah, me too. When everything is more calm and Leia's eating better, um, I think we would love to meet all of you guys and we would love to see the faces behind all of the sweet comments that we get. All right, last question. This question is pretty funny. This is from Isabel Del Rome. What is Leia's first car going to be? You know, it's sitting right outside. <laughs> uh, we bought this Forerunner last year. And we're gonna keep it for 20 years or even yes. more. It's gonna last for a long time. It's gonna time. last forever. Toyotas run forever and we got that and I know Leia's gonna love it when she becomes what, 16, 17, yeah. 18, whatever the age is gonna be at that time. I can picture her driving this car and she's gonna love it. Huh. Heck yeah. Huh. She's gonna be like, mm, I got the phone yeah. runner. I just oh. thought it would be a fun car for her because it's very safe yes. and you know if there were accidents. And it's, it's reliable. It's very reliable. We don't have to worry about anything. Yeah. Yeah. She can do anything she wants with that car. Alright, so that's all we have for today. There was a lot, a lot of questions and we decided to answer a bunch of fun questions today. Thank you guys for tuning into this Q&A. We might do more in the future. Just let us know what you guys want us to do in the comments box below. We hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, comment. Do all that you can. 
because we love you guys and we want to keep this going. So, so next time, Ooh. we'll see you guys. Bye. bye. Say bye, bye, Leia. Leia. Bye, 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 bye. She doesn't care about anything but her banana right now. Banana? Banana. She's going ham. Yep.